If you're looking for a story that's going to inspire you, look no further. You're about to meet a man who just opened a wine store in Manhattan, but not just any wine store. There is something profound about this place because the man who opened it has been paralyzed for years. And how he designed his new business, well, that's what makes this an inspiring story. Here's Safan Kim. I remember visiting a winery at the age of 13 um, in Bordeaux, and I remember that distinctive smell, um, just the, the beauty of it all. For Yannick Benjamin, wine ran in his blood. Both his parents are French, his mother from Bordeaux, surrounded by vineyards. His father worked in the restaurant business. But how he paired his love for wine with a wheelchair-accessible wine store, that was the result of the former sommelier being paralyzed in a car accident at the age of 25. Uh, how am I going to work around the restaurant as a sommelier, as a waiter, as a manager, because it's physically demanding? So I always say the obstacle is the way. Um, and through tragedy, um, you, you can, it really forces you to think outside the box. Then during the pandemic, while he was working in a restaurant, an industry at the time with an uncertain future, he spotted what was then an empty storefront in Hell's Kitchen, in the neighborhood he grew up in, in the building he currently lives in. An idea was born. I, have to, I can shop here independently with comfort. I don't have to keep asking for someone. I can grab a bottle on my own too. Just before the holidays, Beau Pierre Wines and Spirits opened its doors. Displays at eye level for people in wheelchairs. Countertops at the right height. They say some shy away from wine because it's inaccessible. Benjamin is giving wine accessibility a whole new meaning. Well, I can tell you people who have strollers are very, very happy with this, right? <laughs> and, and so, they, you know, all they have to do is press the button, the door opens and all that kind yeah. of stuff. The store even has business cards in Braille. Benjamin's grandfather was blind and his cousin is blind, so he wanted to make sure that this space is accessible to everyone. Now you're going to buy a bottle of wine. Now I can come roll over here. Taking top shelf to a new level. 